Hey everyone, it's Noah here from NS Headquarters. Um, so I know I tell you guys sometimes in videos when I, um, I say that the Cavs are doing really well and stuff and all that stuff, just very small stuff, but I do believe they are going to make the playoffs totally because like, I feel like the Cavs get better every game. I mean, they get better every single game this year and like, okay, so let's just go back to last year. All right. So last year. We had Andre Drummond, Sexton, Garland, Prince, um, Chetty. We had some great people that could easily, like, start doing well right away. Um, so last year I did believe we had a seven to seven. We were like seven and seven at one point, and we were playing the Nets, and that's when we started winning games. And then we got injuries, and then that led us to our worst inning record, which we had like two times. We had like two ten game losing streaks, which really sucked because of the injuries. Like, if we didn't have as many injuries as we had that season, I think we would have gotten between, like, 30 to 35 wins, but not enough to a playoff spot, but a, mu a much improvement no matter what. Like, so, yeah. um, This year, totally, I think we're definitely making the playoffs because we're off to an 18 to 12 start, and we're in the fourth place in the Eastern Conference, and I don't really see us going anywhere if we stay healthy. Like, at least just mostly healthy, not, like, like, 500 players in during hundred team but like if it's like day to day then that's okay like sexton it's okay if he's out like we're gonna do fine if he's out so yeah so anyway okoro has been playing well i hate that people hate on him for like just for stupid reasons like he they say he can't shoot he sucks the the dude can play on the guy when he's on defense it's mostly his defense that is the good thing like he plays right on him he's like this um, so yeah, so it's just like he's super good and he's scoring really well these last like four games. So he's going to be in a, he's going to just give him some time. He will be developing into a star. Darius Garland, on the other hand, he's something else. I can't, I can't even believe he's 21. He reminds me so much of Kyrie Irving. He plays like he's like in his prime already. It's insane how much you grew like that. I thought he was a bust in his first season. I was like, this guy isn't good. He's not going to do anything, but here we are now, and he is averaging almost 20 points a game and, like, eight assists, which is great. Um, so, Jared Allen, Darius Garland, um, and our bench is super underrated. Like, people don't even know, like, who's on our bench. We literally have Ricky Rubio, Kevin Love, who are on the same team, like, five years ago, and they played so well together, and we got Chetty Osman, and yeah. Those three players are, like, really good. Like, Kevin Love is not considered an all-star, but I consider him, like, a really good role player. And Rubio is just that veteran guy who's not much of a scorer, but can really play make and get steals. Um, we also just have a really good third string, by the way. Like, we have Lamar Stevens. I think he's very aggressive and stuff. And, um, yeah, I mean, we got a really good team, like, we also got Evan Mobley, who's, he plays like a veteran. Like, he plays like Chris Bosh. He plays, like, I say between, like, a Chris Bosh and a Kevin Garnett. So, yeah, like, how we're playing right now is amazing. We're second place in defense. Um, we could do a little better in offense, but this is why we're winning games. Because every defense, we're second place in the whole NBA, which is amazing. Because we have a... We have a tower lineup. We have three seven footers starting. Or two. Because Jared Allen is six foot eleven. But yeah, I really think if we keep doing this, we are going to make the playoffs and maybe I think we're gonna get like forty five win the wins this year. And we'll make a playoff spot and we'll just see what happens from there, alright? Um if you made it through the whole video, thank you. Um make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time, alright? Bye guys.